here i'm going to show how we can successfully configure the uh, firebase here i already configure but uh, the new firebase configuration you, i got the error like this uh, firebase is not uh, configured correctly you can see this is the firebase configuration issue when i doing i will show the solution for this i got the same error for uh, android and also ios i will show how we can solve now i click the my uh, android app and uh, i just click the csdk and first we need to download the uh, google json file i already done this one uh, and i paste it in android and inside the app folder see i already done the procedure and the second thing uh, second thing is uh, we need to add the line in our build.gradle file in the project level build.gradle file not in the app gradle file i am already done that one also but still my uh, error is not gone uh, you need to paste like this not like the id uh, we need to just copy the com.google gms google service and uh, you need to paste like this class path and give the name and also version i already given and the third step uh, we need to copy the id and plug in in the app level gradle file not in the build.gradle file you need to copy the id and we need to paste it in the our project uh, we need to open the app and inside the app there is a build.gradle file and i already paste i done the three step correctly but still i got the same error uh, uh, build out grid file like this you need to paste like this not like id you need to paste like apply plugin like this the new version it's uh, in id form so the next step we need to copy paste the dependency and uh, we need to paste in the last of the build.gradle file inside the app folder this one also i done and you can see when i run uh, i got the error in ios and android now i will show the what was solution what is the solution here uh, inside the uh, main dot uh, main app uh, make sure uh, you need to call the widget ensure initialize and next uh, normally i initialize the firebase firebase dot initialized app and i need to now i pass the options this is the solution for this issue now i pass the option firebase options and i need to pass api key app id messaging sender id and also project id i need to pass this parameter see when i run uh, I, i get the error so i need to pass this one for android uh, i'll i'll show Uh, before i am going to add the ios also so i am download the google service dot info dot p list file now i only add the android now i copy paste the file and i am going to paste in the ios folder and insert the ios folder insert the runner i paste the 
google service dot p list i am already done this one from this uh, we got the all data for uh, firebase initialize option the api key uh, this one is my api key so i just copy paste and i paste it in the api key and the next is app id here uh, uh, i will show this is the google app id so i'm just copy paste the app id also and i paste it in the app id now i first configure for ios uh, later i will configure for android the next one is uh, messaging center id here okay gcm center id this is the messaging center id i just copy paste that one also okay the last one is project id and i copy paste the project id also okay now i complete the Okay, now I am going to run. See, uh, now my app is running successfully in the iOS device without any issue. So, this is the latest solution for the issue. Now, we successfully configure the iOS. Now, uh, we need to do the Android. So, I am making the condition platform dot is android is ios uh, uh, will already done and else if it is uh, not android uh, in my case my app only in ios and android so if it is not ios uh, my app working in android so i just uh, copy paste the same and uh, we need to change the data for this, uh, I'm open the Android folder, and uh, we need to open the downloaded that uh, Google service dot uh, JSON file, and here uh, we need to copy paste the same. Uh, it's the current key is the our API key. Okay, now I replace the. api key for android which yeah okay the second one is uh, app id i copy paste the app id also and uh, next one is uh, messaging center id we can copy paste uh, api key is uh, not uh, same for the ios and android uh, both are different the first only the same the last is different so for ios and android api key is different now we need to copy paste the messaging send ready
I think the project number is the messaging sent ready. So I just copy paste the messaging sent ready. Messaging sent ready is a project number. The last one is project ID. Can find the project ID. Rapid Flutter ADB 79. I also copy paste that one also. Okay, the project ID is uh, same for iOS and Android, both are same. Now we can uh, run the app in Android. I will turn on the emulator. Okay, now I run the app in Android device. It's take some time. Because I am first time installing. Yeah, now our app is run successfully without any issue. Now I just restart. See, without any issue, the app is successfully installed so this is the solution for this thank you